fusion cell here. I have a, a new prison being set up right here. I thought I'd do a little bit of prison architect since <laughs> Hawthorn wasn't going so well. Uh, a new prison being set up. Okay, so one, one second. So I always have a hard time um, building um, up to a certain point. There's a uh, and plus it gets really laggy on the computer when when you have a uh, is it over mm, I think mine starts to get laggy around a hundred. Um, hundred prisoners, but then I don't know how many guards you need to. <laughs> I use a lot because I don't want riots, I don't want murders, <laughs> I don't want them es escaping either, so... Right, so I'm going to do this one as the uh, reception. And I usually start off with a um, I do need offices too. Um, Hi, Mr. Gamer. I just start off with um, building some um, holding cells first. Uh, let me see. Try to make it pretty big. Something like that. And then, so what I've always done is, oops, I would put the showers in with the. Uh, well, when I have a holding cell, I just have its own shower. But I'm wondering if it would be better to keep the shower separate. You know, maybe put it somewhere. Somewhere here. And I do need electricity. What? I always forget that. <laughs> so busy doing other things. Oops. One over there. I'm just putting it all in. Eventually I'm gonna need it. Oh, thank you. <laughs> yeah, I get more views when I'm playing um, popular games. So, um, I just streamed Journey to the Center of Pockthorn and I didn't have anyone. <laughs> and I wasn't really getting anywhere with that game either. So I moved to Prison Architect. Hmm. 
going to need canteen too, so need space and all that. Um, so this is a holding cell. Reception is here. And need to put the offices together. Always bad at planning for the offices. I think I'll put um visitation here. And I need a perimeter fence. Uh Otherwise, they're going to escape, and it's not going to be cool. Oops. Good thing they you start off on um, a small plot of land. Enough money to work with. Wait. Oops. So staff door, um, and then metal detector, because they can get all kinds of um, luxuries and um, is it and drugs sometimes when um. They're having visitation. The utilities in. So I don't have it on really, really fast speed right now because I'm mean, still building it, still planning it. Uh, to figure out how to do this space though. The, uh, the entrance. So I've done, I've done these doors, and I've done. Um, so could do this and then put brick wall. <laughs> so we need office table or office desk table and chair. Wah. So and then, um, holding cell, you just have to have a bench and a toilet, which means I need to put the water pump out. <laughs> Why do I like The Sims 2? Um, well, I've played The Sims 3. I didn't like Sims 3 so much, um, mostly because of the microtransactions. Hi, godly cookie. Um, and um, I didn't like the graphics or the build mode in Sims 3. I don't know, I just didn't get used to it. And I mean, I have Sims 3, and it's pretty much the same engine as uh, Medieval Sims, which I like to play, so I, I don't know. I just didn't I didn't like Sims 3 that much. I like Sims 2 uh, because I played Sims 1, and Sims 1 was pretty good, um, especially for 2000. And then um, Sims 2 came out, and that was pretty good. It was a good improvement from Sims 1. I have Sims 4. Um, 
It, Sims 4 is just sort of disappointing though. Um, I don't know. There's just a lot missing in it. Um, like for example, the hot tubs. Those are always in the game, always in the base game especially, and Sims 4 doesn't have it. It's now in one of those um, stuffs packs. To connect those pipes. Um, I do feel like Sims 4 is, um, sort of celebrating Sims 1 and Sims 2. So, I do like it better than Sims 3. So, I would rank it Sims, Sims 2, um, Sims 1, Sims 4, and then Sims 3. Um, I don't know, I'm, I'm one of the ones that didn't really enjoy Sims 3 so much. Okay, so toilet bench, yeah, that's because I have them building on it. <laughs> They'll never finish. I could hire a couple more. Call of Duty, um, I don't actually, I've never really played that. Uh, I did give it to, um, my husband for his, for, not his birthday, uh, I think it was for anniversary. He has the one with the dog that came out a couple years ago or last year. And he was telling me it was pretty awesome, and then... Especially because you got to play with the dog. <laughs> I just started playing Agario. That is too addictive. Oh my gosh. They now have it on mobile, so you can get it on the Google Play Store, or I guess iTunes Store. And... Um, I think I like the, uh, web browser version. I think it was Ghosts, I'm not sure. But if it's the one with the dog, then... Jeez, these guys are slow. Oh, I need to put in, um, staff rooms, too. So, has to be offices have to be four by four, and then staff rooms. Yeah, I just downloaded Agario for the mobile device for my phone and it's harder <laughs> to control especially if you have a big touch screen and then you accidentally split your cells <laughs> it's still fun though it's so weird that that is popular but Spore never got um, as popular as that because Spore, the, okay so the first phase of Spore is essentially that idea where you're just like chomping other cells And I did enjoy Spore. Um, it does get a little boring. On, oh, no. um, is it when, um, when you get to the space stage on a private server? Sure, um, you can uh, leave me a message on the details, and you might join. Um, let's 
so building four by four. So you have to measure it out as six by six, I think. Two, three, four, yep. I'm gonna have to do it like this because they're not building that part of the fence. Um, I don't know, as soon as I'm done with the stream, I can probably join. But not too long. It's it's almost um. Oh, now they build it. Um, it's almost dinner time here, so. I'm in America. <laughs> I don't know if you can tell by the accent. I'm American. It's a boring American accent. <laughs> oh wow. So you're you're in um Europe then, right? I'm thinking Germany about there. If it's midnight, I I don't know. <laughs> I'm just guessing. I wonder if this is a bug where they don't build the walls when there's a fence around it. The only reason I know is. Um, that's Europe is because I had a friend that lived in Europe, so, um, when I would talk to him around, you know, midnight, he would be at work, so. But he was in Germany, he was in, uh, Stuttgart, Stuttgart. But every now and then, he would also be in England, so. Scotland, cool. <laughs> well, hello from the United States. My dog is uh, Scottish. She's not Scotty, but her heritage is from Scotland. <laughs> She's a Westie. And then... Now we're thinking about getting another dog, so we're thinking about getting a Scotty. Um, let's see. This was gonna be visitation. Isn't it rainy and um, it's it's foggy there, right? Um, so, okay, so with the holding cells, <laughs> um, to avoid the fights, sometimes I would put in... So I, I figured out I could put in these beds. 
that relieves some of that. I can only put in so much because I only have. I'm not playing pure sandbox. Just gonna make visitations a problem. Yeah. <laughs> I can't even hire a warden, oh my gosh. It's just raining and raining and raining. Actually, uh, so where I'm from in America, I'm, I'm, I live in Colorado. Um, we've been having a lot of rain. It, like one morning I woke up and it was so foggy that, um, it looks like, um, you know, somewhere in Europe, it was so, uh, like, it, it's unusual for us to have this type of weather. Um, it's been unusually wet for us, too. So. <laughs> in some ways, I prefer rain, because I don't know how it, how it works over there, but over here, um, when it rains, and then at night, it'll cool off, and it feels so amazing with the windows open. Um, I don't know. It could be because it's it's sort of deserty here. We're in the plains, so it doesn't just stay humid all the time. But this summer has been really wet. Because we've had, um... We had a week straight of thunderstorms and rain, and today we got some rain. It's cloudy today. I mean, you could even look up the weather map for this area, and it's completely covered. Um, a couple weeks ago, we had tornado warning, and that was pretty scary because they, um, because it was already hot, and I guess. Um, when you have really hot temperatures like that, you can, um, I guess the atmosphere will create some kind of supercell and it just ends up swirling in clouds. I don't know for sure, but that's just what the weather guy said. Um, and, um, what is it? We would, so that that th uh, tornado warning that was freaky because um, my husband said that um, what is it? You know a tornado is nearby when you can hear what sounds like trains coming by. And the weird thing is that I didn't hear trains. I heard I heard marching like you know a, a, a troop of army men marching down the street <laughs> and it was very frightening I think um cuz we have so the plains area is sort of known for tornadoes and having a particular time of season or a year for um tornadoes so for for us it's May through June um uh I think it's because it's dry and then you have you know you have the clouds above so that gives off the cool air and then in the summer it's really hot so when the hot and the cold start to mix you get these weird um, funnel clouds I think I think that's how they're formed because I know it has to do with the air pressure I used to be interested in tornadoes when I was a kid so I'm thinking that's how it how they're formed it's the difference in the air pressure But yeah, that one was frightening. We had a little bit of hail. We had the the marching sounds. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, I didn't connect it to the electricity. Okay, so I have enough money to get a warden finally. Oh, I can't even go in. 
And a visitation table. So I wonder what the uh, final game is going to look like, because I remember hearing that the developers were saying that this year was the goal. Um, they were going to finish it off this year. Or at least finish the alpha phase. But, I mean, for an alpha, this is pretty good. I, like, especially after they've done those, uh, ugh, because of the last couple bug bashes. This runs very smoothly. Oh, I forgot to put the showers in. <laughs> Um, I forgot to put the canteen in as well, oh my gosh. These poor prisoners are never going to eat. Yeah. I usually make them big, I don't know why. So maybe canteen will be that big, and then kitchen, something like that. Why aren't they taking care of him? Oh my gosh. Oh, I don't have solitary confinement. So the problem I have is when you get the prison big enough that you have to separate the, the various um, levels of security. And, um, I don't, I don't know, it's just like running five different prisons when you do that, and I don't think my computer can run that. I have a pretty good video card and processor, but... Okay, I can put the showers in now. Oops. Um, once I get this canteen build up, I'm gonna um end the stream and then and then I'll play some. And yeah, you can just send me a message on here, on the just the private message, because you said it's a private server. Oh, I'm mobile. Um, I usually play as guest. I don't really use my login because I'm or use any logins. Hi, Godly. Okay, so this guy can't even move until I build a solitary. Oh my gosh. Oh, 
Okay, so okay, so you can't get the um, death row inmates until you do the bureaucracy. Uh, Well, it asks you to log in. I think that's the web browser, but um, uh, mobile, I just. I see. Okay, I see. Okay, yay. I didn't realize that was done. Okay. Um, let's see. Get that door. Need staff door. Oh, I didn't put that wall in. It's nice playing um, with a smaller prison like this because things actually run to be all the time. Probably have to redesign this at some point. <laughs> Canteen built up. Electricity over. Oh, are you serious? Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, yeah, there's no login, but on the web version, it asks you if you want to log in with your Facebook or with um, some other social media. But yeah, I know, you can, you can type in your own nickname. Uh, where's your prison, Godly? Is it on the, um, Steam community? thing or workshop or okay so I think that's pretty good you got a basic prison here reception shower visitation warden um not enough guards yet but okay it's in the workshop oh I'll, ch I'll check it out um So, so yeah, basic prison right here. Just need to get the water running there. Um, so I think this is a good place to stop. Uh, if you like the stream, as usual, hit the follow button, and you'll be notified when I start streaming. If that's still working, I don't know. Um, and um, let's see, I'll be streaming again on Wednesday, same time. I think I put down Mafia too, but I don't know if that's gonna work. So we'll see. I might stream Eleanor. Um, I can I can look at it. Um, let me see. He said workshop. Okay. 
Okay. I'm gonna look up Godly's um Godly's prison. Godly cookies, amazing prison. Okay. Then I'll do this. Oops, wrong one. Okay. Okay. Wow. Oh my goodness. So that's a uh, Godly's uh, prison right there. <laughs> um, how many people does that hold? Uh, you can just uh, isn't there a way that you can private message people on um, on Twitch? Geez, how is that possible? Cause I've I have a prison that has about two hundred inmates, and it doesn't. Um, my computer just cannot handle that. Does your computer handle this? <laughs> um. Hmm. Okay, so um, I think if my name shows up in the chat and you click on my name, um, you can send me a message, I think. Okay. Hi, everyone. Dang. Yeah, I have one that has about 200. I can pull that one up, too. <laughs> All right. Um, so I'll save it. No. I'm just gonna call this, uh... Come on, let me type it in. Practice. And then, here, I'll load up one of my old prisons. <laughs> oh my gosh. This one? No. Um... This is another big one. Um, I don't think this is the biggest one that I have, actually. See, it's... <laughs> the counter here is going up. Uh, I think it's... still going up. Yeah, I only have 4,000, <laughs> but this one holds 400, and my computer is just kind of crawling right now. Look at that. <laughs> See, if I if I put it on fast forward, it, there's no difference. <laughs> but yeah, uh, this is I think this is one of the biggest ones I have. Um, I I just can't figure out the how you split it up without everyone beating each other up kind of thing. That's the hard part. But 
But I do have the uh, canteen separated, and I do have one massive kitchen. Uh, I think Cookie can. I think. He, let me see something. Okay, so I I sent you a message, Mr. Gamer. So if you check your messages on Twitch, then um, you can respond to my thread with the info. All right, so I'm gonna end it here, and um, I'll play this some other day. And if you like the video, you like the stream, um, hit the follow button, and. I think Twitch notifies you when I start streaming. Um, so, thanks for watching, and hope to see you all soon. Have a great day, evening. Yep. And don't forget to have fun. Bye.